Despite some recent rainfall, it hasn't been enough, leaving farmers in southeastern Minnesota still dealing with drought conditions. KIMG News 3's Jerome Barnett spoke with a scientist from Wasika's Southern Research and Outreach Center. He joins us live in Olmstead County with how farmers are handling these conditions. Jerome. Jesse Tyler, the research center says that most corn and soybean crops in southeastern Minnesota are already close to maturity. That means any rain those crops get between now and harvest season won't help at all. Even though it may not help this year's yield, the center says corn and soybean farmers in our area would like to get some rain after their harvest. That's because farmers hope the moisture will freeze in the ground once it gets colder. Then, once it warms up again in the spring, growers will hopefully be able to use that thawed moisture for planting. Well, I think the mood across farmers this year is um, many are fortunate to get what they had. Um, I think there's some areas that have been really bad, focused maybe in Fillmore and Mauer County. I think people that are not in that exceptionally dry area are feeling quite lucky. He tells me farmers in our area could use a couple of inches of rain in the fall to make it easier on their tillage equipment. Live in Olmsted County, Jerome Barnett, KIMT News 3. Thank you, Jerome. The research center says the lack of rain means farmers in our area likely won't have to deal with as much mud when they harvest their crops this season. Which is actually some good news as farmers' equipment can, of course, get stuck in that mud so drier soil can better handle the weight of farming equipment.